Welcome back to Green Hell. I've got worms. Well, we've got a worm in our something, somewhere, probably in one of our arms. Yeah, it's just burrowed right in there. Look at how gross that looks. So we're going to take one of these bone needles. Oh man, I'm down to only two bone needles. But we'll get more. And let's just take one of these bandages. Just the regular leaf bandage. And slap it on there. Okay, great. That should take care of that. But what? why do I still have that symbol on me? Uh, there's something else going on. I probably have leeches as well. Or something else. I don't see anything else. Oh god, I've got another freaking worm. Great. Oh, oh, I've got fish bone needles too. Great. Well, let's use this other bone needle and dig out this worm. Oh, great. And leave a big hole in our arm like that. And this is why I carry so many bandages, man. This is crazy. Get that wrapped up. All right. Now, both arms are leaf wrapped. Yummy. Let's, uh, let's see here. We're going to make more bandages. We're going to do a little bit of crafting today to get started. And we're going to have to take care of our needs. We'll get ourselves healthy, I hope. And there we go. All right. So we've still got two tobacco dressings, two lily dressings, and uh, several of these leaf bandages. So that's good. But we've also got a bunch of bird feathers, and we're going to continue making arrows with them. Yeah, we've got small sticks now. So we're going to just craft up a bunch of arrows. And then we're going to go hunt a, a freaking jaguar. I know how that sounds, but <laughs> we're going to do it anyway. We're going to, because we've got, the cool thing is we've got a place now to save. So before we do that, after I get all the crafting taken care of here, we're just going to go into that freaking cave and hunt that cat. Now, I'm hopeful that that cat is too big to get out of the cave because the cave you know there's parts of it that are pretty freaking narrow and so with these arrows we might just be able to deal with that cat um, oh I need another feather there we go and I think that's the last right so with these arrows now that's seven only seven arrows I don't know it may or may not work for us but that's what we've got so let's you know what? let's check our stats and see what we need yeah look our water and oh man we need carbs bad but the water's gonna help the water's gonna help a great deal it's a good thing we had all these freaking bowls but I think I yeah I accidentally picked one up and let's just drop that right there okay so, um, I want to look around just quickly here and see, okay, we, oh, there's some fruit. That's what I was after. That's what we needed. Now, our hydration, yeah, we still need more hydration, but mainly we just needed the fruit. And, uh, you know what, we're going to eat one of these capybara meats. Oh, that helped a bit too. Eat that, we're going to just harvest that for maggots and we're gonna move that coconut away from them yeah I want to get my uh, health up as high as I can by eating this stuff yeah and that's actually put us in a pretty decent spot um, a few more yeah let's see oh, I'll get all these sticks and stuff out here but I'm not gonna really worry about that we're going to um, just take one more gander here for another plant. I'm uh, not seeing any. Yeah, no more fruits or whatever. And that's, yeah, that's pretty much it. We got nothing else. We just orange juice, but we don't really need to do the orange juice. Oh my god, I'm carrying around painkillers. I bet you that would have helped us with our fever. 
<laughs> we might have, might have avoided uh, at least passing out one of the three times we passed out last night. But, okay, we're not going to worry about that. We're just going to pull out our freaking bow. We're going to go in here and try and confront a big, huge, man-eating cat. So, now, see, it gets right in this area that the cat might not be able to get through. It probably could get through this side. But if we entice it over here... Oh, God, that thunder scared me. I thought it was a cat. So if we, like, I don't know, if we scare the cat or get the cat... We're not going to scare it. If we get the cat to follow us through here, we might be okay. Maybe. I don't know. But, oh, what I do know is before we do this ridiculous harebrained scheme, we're going to just go back here and save up. Oh, and fruit. Great. Great, great, great. All right, let's just eat all that fruit real quick. I could have just eaten it straight off the tree. I don't know what I was thinking, but I, I clearly wasn't thinking. All right, but we're going to go. Where Where's our little encampment thing? Here we go. Some, somewhere over here. No snakes, please. No snakes. Where, where the hell was it? God, I can't see anything. What the hell? Okay, there's a log. Where's our thing? It's like camouflaged or something. Didn't we set up camp? We did set up a camp here, didn't we? Somewhere. Oh my god, okay, I went way past it. But we're going to drink some more water while we're here. We're just drink that. And now, uh, not sleep, but save. Good grief. Okay. All right, yeah, day 13. Oh, did I just shoot one of my arrows on accident while I was saving? I think I did. Where did it go, though? I thought I saw an arrow. What, what, do we have a freaking leech on us again. Good God. How many times? Ah. Hearing noises. I mean, it is a jungle, so... Where... But, yeah, I could have swore... We inadvertently shot off an arrow, but... Oh, oh no, it's a small stick. I just wanted to make sure, because I don't think six arrows is going to be... I don't think seven arrows is going to be enough either. But, um, you know, worst comes to worst, we have a spear also. Where's that cave, though? I thought it was pretty close here. There it is. All right. Uh, the foolhardy idea is now in full effect. Oh, and there's the arrow. How did it get all the way in there? Who knows? It, <laughs> it like wound its way through. Okay. Where are you, cat? Did it, did it just take off during the night? Was it even ever in here? This is a beautiful place, but I'm super nervous about being in here. Oh, see, this would have been a nice place to to set up a little bit of a, a camp, and there's obsidian stones in here. Which reminds me. This is a fairly new... The thing is, I'm getting so good with making the, the stone axes and bone axes that their durability is going up and up and up. Um, and I don't know if that's going to remain the same if we start making obsidian stuff. But I think I'm going to take a couple of these obsidian stones just so we can make stuff with them. I wonder if we can make an obsidian spear. That would be nice. I, the, the spear is like my preferred weapon in this game. It's the best.
but it is kind of a one-shot weapon if you throw it so that uh, yeah it can be problematic when you're dealing with a kitty cat that cannot be one-shotted and you know peccaries they they the capybaras and peccaries they don't fight back so all right well we've got a lot of the obsidian stones now so we can oh look more fruit just waiting for us out here all right well I don't know what happened to the cat I'm glad it's gone I mean I was kind of looking forward to a little excitement there with it but um, you know we we get to live another day and that's not a bad thing so all right well we got our hut here we've got uh, our food situation is looking really great uh, we got all this obsidian taking up tons of space in our inventory but that's okay we'll deal with that um, yeah all right well off we go capybara oh do we have we never set up a campfire here we've got two fibers and this has got 11 hours left on it Let's go ahead and eat this fruit. We'll probably shoot one of these capybaras. I don't want to waste the arrows on them, though, because, honestly, they're so easy with the spear. Oh, yeah, well, if you don't get too close to them, that is. But, all right, well, there's a pathway here. So, 4616, is that, is that fruit or is that just the flowers, uh, it's just colored flowers. All right. I just want to check around, before we head further east, I'm going to check around here and see, you know, let's get this. <gasps> kind of want to cruise the cliff edge a little bit see what we can see from up here hopefully not get bitten by another snake oh it's like the valley of the birds down there I want to check that out have we been down there like we came here it was afternoon we I think I don't know. I don't know. Let's check this out before we go further east. Yeah, I think we we were higher up or something. I don't know. I can't remember where I've been like five minutes ago. Oh, but there's, yeah, coconut. <gasps> yeah, we're out of coconut bowls right now because they're all up at a, our other camp up there. But this place, oh, and there's fruit. This is good. This is what we need. Keep us really healthy. And, oh, tobacco. And yeah, we're going to want to resupply. Uh, in fact, let's go ahead and just craft another one of those type of bandages. Uh, do, do, do this. No, this. And leaf bandage. There we go. Good. So now we got three of these tobacco dressings again. That's nice. And I think we can go ahead and harvest one of them. Now we've got three fibers again. And all right, it's good. All right, let's go down here into the Valley of the Birds. Okay, there's a carcass there. You know, I think I want with the bone. I don't have any bones on me right now. What the hell? Come on, give me that bone. Oh, I can't take it. We got too much stuff here. Unknown herbs. These unknown herbs 
Yeah, they make lily dressings. We relocate everything. I got this stingray sting. I don't have any idea what that's for, if it's even for anything. Uh, and charcoal, I do know charcoal can be used to, like, settle your stomach if you uh, get food poisoning. Whoa, how is that so big? It's a bone. Expand? Take. I can't take it. I still can't take it. Why can't I take it? That's weird. Alright, well, to hell with the bone. I'm not going to mess around all day with inventory stuff, but I just want to look around. Is there another cave here? Wait a minute. I thought this was all like a little lagoon or something. Was that just the rain? It's not a lagoon here. And what happened to all the birds? Okay, they're still up there. Okay, now I feel like we're totally backtracking, aren't we? What direction are we going in? Yeah, pretty much west. And north. It's just this map is so varied and so well laid out that even small areas, you could just go around and around and find all kinds of interesting cool stuff. Yeah, is there another cave here or something? No, I'm not seeing one. Now we're totally going back the way we came, aren't we? Yeah, it's, wow. So easy to get lost here. I'm so glad I've got a compass. Because I've already gone in circles more than once. More fruit. And, you know, do we even have... Okay, let's eat this, because it's just going to go bad. And let's eat some of these fruits. And then, oh, there's a gappy bar over there. Let's see about maybe hunting that. Yeah, another, another place for to make a camp. Uh, is that a snake? It is a snake, and that's a capybara. I'd rather get the capybara than the snake, but... The snake. The snake is an easier target, frankly. Here, let's just do it this way. I mean, I know I could just walk up and stab it, and it wouldn't be able to bite me, but my W key sometimes gets stuck. <laughs> that is not something I want to deal with if I'm just trying to take a one step forward. For a snake, uh, with my luck, it would get stuck, and we would just get bit. But, I think we have done enough. Oh, God! What the hell? Oh, my God! No, see? And that's, again, I just... The W key just got stuck. I mean, the first the first time, it got me legit. But you, God. Doc, I just... These snakes. Man. Man, oh, man. All right, so now we're going to make it back to our other camp. If I can find it. Wait. Where is it, though? we got to get down from here. I, oh, and I need to put a dressing on. Um, all right, so, holy moly. Uh, let's, here, in here, take the thing like this. And, oh, get the leech off of us. And which leg got it? It had to have been a leg bite, right? No. I know we got bit. Where is the bite? Where's the snake bite? Didn't we get bit by that snake just now? What happened? Did the leech just suck the blood, the, the venom out, or what? 
we don't seem to be under the effects of a snake bite. Okay, that that is blowing my brain out. What are we immune now? We've been bit enough that I'm like immune to the poison or something. Well, however that worked out, I I'm glad it worked out because I'm not done exploring. It's just so much. It's so easy to get completely lost. Oh, here we go. Look at these coconuts. Another flat area to make a another another nice little camp if you wanted to. See if I was smart and I wanted to take the time to do it, we could just um, put up a little shelter at every single one of those little spots. And then I would know we've been here before and we can just save and so forth but I'm not doing that oh my god well you know what we're not gonna find that other camp again are we that that new camp we just made and are we heading west that's the thing are we heading west no we're heading east East, that's the way we wanted to head, right? I think. Yeah, because we are at, I think, about the northwest corner of the map. But then again, I don't know what the dimensions of the map are. And what the actual edges are. Because it's just, it's just almost impossible to tell that kind of thing. A road. Let's follow this road. Maybe we'll run into a village or something. I don't know, but it's getting dark and I feel safer on the road. Less chance of a snake bite. I could have swore we got bit by a snake. And there's a it's just a stick. No one panic. I have no idea where I'm going now. Where, which direction are we heading? We're still heading east. It's so dark now. Oh my god. Oh, I can't see a darn thing. Alright, okay, moon. Moonlight is good, right? Did we find the road again? I think we found the road again. Okay. There's a peccary right there. And another peccary. Okay. And we're... Wait, which direction are we going? North. So we're kind of going north and east this whole time. That's fine. And you think with a, a road like this, 
we're going to run into some kind of man-made structure sooner or later. Yes, look, okay. Oh, wow, all right. What is this? I can wish I could see it better. But there's there's a jeep down there. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I'm going to try and get down there. Let's get our spear ready in case there's a snake. Probably a freaking snake. But yeah, somebody... Oh, what is this? Uh, bidden empty. Okay. And painkillers. I'm glad they highlight. Candy bar. And I saw snacks too. Snacks. Oh, no space. Alright, well, let's eat something then. What do we need? We need carbs. Alright, let's eat. Oh my god, it's a... Uh, this is... It's like an actual canteen. Alright, let's just eat these. And Oh, we... Yeah, let's go ahead and eat those chips. That'll take care of our carbs, right? And now we can take that, right? And can we squeeze it up here? Yeah, it'll fit. Brilliant! And now... ha! we're maxed out on everything. That's brilliant. Thank you, overturned jeep. You just saved us. That was brilliant. And how beautiful is this? Like, minus the industrial waste barrel and the overturned rotten jeep. Uh, the moonlight is pretty. This <laughs> is retarded. Disregard the other stuff. Well, cool. We found another kind of landmarky type thing. I mean, I don't think I can sleep in that jeep or save the game there, but we found something interesting, and I like it. Man, I love this map. These guys did a fantastic job. Creepy Jar, you have my vote. This is a great game, and I know it's only in alpha or early release right now, and I'm really looking forward to the story mode stuff, and you know, whatever else they do, and let's kill this, because I just feel <laughs> aggressive. That peccary had ill intent, I could tell. Yeah, and I got no space for anything. I just killed it, and I can't even get the meat. Alright, well, let's just drink this, and harvest it. And that's going to fall to the ground, too. And then we'll eat that. And then we'll eat that. And now we can pick up the peccary meat. Fine. Great. Okay, good. Uh, another thing I could do is, we, you know, these are empty. I'm just going to drop one. That'll give us a lot more space to carry stuff. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, 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 no. No, no, no. That was a big cat. And I do not want to try and deal with one in the middle of the night when I have zero energy. Is it coming this way? Is it somewhere close? I don't know. I'm so scared. Those things freaking scare me. I mean, just that growl alone is enough for me to just hightail it. You know, I don't even have to see it. I don't really care where it is as long as it's not on my butt. Or in my face. Wherever it is, I don't want to be near it. Okay. Well, fortunately, we've got lots of moonlight here. Um... I want to go up that road more, but that's this cat. The cat is a problem, right? And, like, I don't know. Look at this tree. Look at how this is. You know, from up here, we could deal with the cat if I had more arrows. I don't think I have enough arrows to deal with that, but... Um, yeah, I'm freaking scared. I, we need a camp. I need some place to save. And... I was hoping we would, like, find a place like that, but, like, I'm not going to deal with a freaking jaguar in the middle of the night. I'm just not going to do it. 
There's no way. So, um, I think, I think I'm gonna just kind of wait the night out here. Maybe we'll build some kind of shelter some somewhere here. And uh, yeah, I call that good. I don't know. Maybe we can build near this. Let's see if can I build something. I'm I'm not opposed to putting up hut shelters every freaking place. I could put them. I don't want to block the road entirely, but if we could squeeze one in here near this, yeah, this would be fine, right? <laughs> yeah, we can do that. So I'll had uh, set up a hut shelter, and then we can save, and then proceed on from there. But I'm not going to put you guys through the ordeal of me trying to get, gather all the crap in the middle of the night and do this. So I'll just say thank you so much for joining. I hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, smash that like button. Leave me any comments, tips, tricks, recommendations, or death threats. Subscribe, share, favorite, do all that great stuff. Wait a minute. Okay, I'm not going to let you go yet because look at this. I think, I think, if I'm not mistaken... These are the palm trees. No, damn it. It's too big. All right, well, I thought it was one that you get hard a palm out of, but it wasn't. Too bad for me. But, yeah, I'll do some more harvesting, and we'll get this shelter built, hopefully, before I pass out. And, uh, yeah, we'll talk with all of you again very, very soon.